You can't support anyone nowadays without someone going, oh, he's glazing, or oh, he's deriding. This is a quick story about how I showed support for someone and everyone made fun of me for it. So I'm a big LeBron fan, and one of my friends who lives in LA, he works for a local news station in Los Angeles, and sometimes he'll get tickets to Lakers games. And so when I was visiting him, he was able to get us both tickets. And with his credentials, his job, we actually got locker room passes and we could be in the locker room at the end of the game. So after the game ends, my buddy and I, we head down to the locker room and once we get in there, we don't see any of the players. And at this point, I'm kind of panicking. I'm like, oh my God, where's King? Where is Daddy Braun? We start walking around the facility and finally I find where the showers are and I see Braun, no clothes on, he walks out of the shower, and I'm kind of just like, I'm staring at greatness, um, and I sort of like, I saw just the size of his meat, so I'm trying so hard not to stare, I'm trying to really just make eye contact with him, so I, I walk up to him, I, I, I put my hand out, I'm like, hey, King, LeBron, so great to meet you, um, and he was like, hey, hey, good to meet you, bro, good to meet you, bro, bro, and we shake hands, and then all of a sudden, I kind of point down to his lower area, and I was like, by the way, man, that looks scrumptious. And security tackled me immediately, but after everything happened, a lot of my friends, like I said, they were calling me a D-rider, calling me a glazer, but it kind of just shows you can't support your idols without being made fun of.